hope everybody will continue to pray. I enjoyed Brother Adrian that message. I always enjoy hearing you and what you've got to say. It always warms my heart. I'm, I'm very thankful to be here tonight and, yeah. and just to get to be with everyone. And, and uh, I know we've got quite a few missing and sure. should have a, a crowd tomorrow to look forward to. And I'm very thankful to be right here right now. Yes. Yeah. There's an opportunity every day. You know, we, we, we plan and we look ahead so often, but it's so important that we just stop and slow down and enjoy God in the moment that we've got right now. Yep. We'll never, ever have this opportunity again. You know what? God created this day and this moment for us, and I want to enjoy it just as much as we can. You know, I worked uh, worked all day today down out at the office, and you know, I was wrapping up trying to get out of there around 4 o'clock or so, and Everybody was asking, well, where are you going? So well, I've got church tonight. i got to get out of here. And, you know, to this world, it's an awfully funny thing to, to, to just take the time on a Saturday night and, you know, trying to get a bunch of them to come out. And it's like, well, you know, we got this going on and we got that going on. And, you know, this this world, and, I, and I'm guilty as everybody, we're, we're so full of excuses and, and, and just looking down the road and saying, well, just one more time, you know, God, just slow me down just a little bit here and, and if the Lord will bless me, maybe I'll preach just a little bit here. But but you know what? If He doesn't, that's all right. There's plenty here that you can use. I'm just so thankful to get to be here tonight. Oh, why? But you know what? God he is the great deliverer here today. And oh, why? When I can find myself out in the middle of a desert land, just feeling like I'm dying of thirst sometimes, Brother Brandon. Oh, why? You know what? And sometimes I feel like, well, uh, look what I've got myself into now. Oh, why? But I can just, uh, uh, this world can just drive me down to my knees, Brother Shad. And that's as far as it can control me. Oh, why? This world. World's got no power over me here. Oh, I am so glad. Oh, my God, He's the master and the commander of all things here in this world. Oh, he came and He lived it all. Oh, and He died a death for you and me. Oh, I to show you that there's nothing that this world's got over you. Oh, he came and died for each one of us here. Oh, I to show you how there's nothing to be afraid of in this world. World. Yeah. Oh, I'm three days uh, down in the tomb. Oh, and here comes, yeah. oh, here comes my yeah, Lord. Oh, I'm the conqueror of all things. Oh, I, I, you think about, oh, 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 oh Jonah, uh, down in the well. Oh, I'm three days, right, three yeah, nights. Right. Oh, I'm down in the, uh, the bottom of the sea. Oh, I, my God, oh, he knew exactly where he was. Uh, Jonah, oh, it's time for you. Uh, to be about my business. Oh, I will. Uh, you think about uh, old Daniel uh, down yeah, in, yeah. Uh, in the ninth den. Yeah. Oh, I just uh, one night down there. Oh, uh, why you think about uh, the peace of my God? Oh, uh, why the peace that you're talking about? Uh, oh, I believe old Daniel. Oh, uh, he was resting in that peace that yes, night. Yeah, oh, why when the king, uh, he didn't rest very much. Oh, uh, why when he woke up, oh, uh, he ran to the top of that den. Oh, roll the stone away. Right. Oh, uh, Daniel, oh, has your God uh, delivered you? Uh, oh, King, I uh, live forever. Yeah, oh, right. my God. Oh, he sent an angel uh, last night. Oh, and everything. Oh, it's going to be all right. Oh, I'm telling you, are you even about your father's business? Oh, are we uh, taking our eyes off? Oh, yeah. I don't feel, oh do we let uh, the world take a hold of us? Oh, I ain't cast us down. Oh, I know I do sometimes. Oh, I think oh, I've got my children. Oh, that I'm trying to plan for. Oh, that I'm trying uh, to prepare something. Oh, that maybe when I leave this world, oh, they'll have uh, something to hold on to. Oh, I bud. Oh, I sometimes. Oh, I just want to throw it all away and say, oh, I let's go down. Oh, I down to the river and just have a oh, find a little peace. I just look to the Lord. Oh, I put the things of this world oh, aside here. 
Oh, I look to my God. Oh, the prophets. Oh, why all them Jeremy? Oh, they lived in the mountains. Oh, why they? Oh, they wander to and fro. Oh, bro. Oh, Apostle Paul. Oh, you never hear him talk about a home. Oh, you never hear. Oh, he was never married. Oh, you never hear him talk about. Oh, I'm kind of tired. I've been on this journey. Oh, a long time. Oh, I'm gonna go home for a little while. Oh, what did he say? Oh, when he was going uh, down to Jerusalem, oh, uh, and they came to him, oh, uh, said, oh, Paul, oh, uh, I don't go down there. Uh, they're going to take you uh, and we'll bind you up oh, uh, and throw you down oh, uh, in the prison. Oh, uh, he didn't say, oh, uh, well, uh, maybe you're right. Oh, uh, they're awfully mean. Oh, uh, the Romans, oh, uh, they're awfully tough. Uh, yeah, the Jews, oh, uh, they want to kill me. Oh, uh, oh, he looked down and said, oh, uh, why me? I don't weep and break my heart. Oh, my God. Oh, not only am I willing to be bound for the cause of Christ, but I'm willing to lay my life yeah. down. Yeah. If that's what it takes. <laughs> seek, seek the greater cause today. You know what I was reading earlier today? Oh, why? I was reading a little bit when, why when Moses and Joshua and all of them was traveling from Egypt's land. And they came up against the land of Canaan there. Now why in Moses he went and God told them, he said, Take ye, uh, why just a few men and send spies among the land here? Why and go and spy it out and see what great things here? Why do I see what I have promised you and see that the land is good? Oh, yeah. uh, why, you know what? And, and Moses he did that. He took 13 of them, I believe it was. Oh, uh, why and he put them down there, Dad? Oh, and it says they spied out the whole land there and they found uh, that it was flowing with milk and honey. Uh, they found, oh, why they cut down one branch full of grapes and two men had to carry it all back to the camp. Uh, for 40 days and 40 nights, they went all round about there. Uh, but they found men and women living down there. Uh, and some of them began to be afraid there, Brandon. Oh, uh, why some of them? Oh, uh, why they saw those giants living in the land? Oh, uh, why? And they come back to Moses. Yeah, and scary. they brought the, uh, all the food there that they found and put it in front of them. Yeah. And said, yeah, uh, the land surely. Oh, uh, it flows with milk and honey. Oh, uh, I look at these great things. Oh, uh, I but somebody spoke up and said, oh, uh, I but Oh, uh, why there's men there. Oh, uh, why the sun? Oh, I have the giants live down there. Oh, they don't live in tents. Oh, they've got great walled cities. Oh, why they were afraid. Yeah. Oh, I'm bud. Oh, I okay, love. Oh, I stood up before them and said, Oh, let us go at once. Yeah. Oh, I possess the I'm land. Oh, I let's go. I get up. Don't make yeah. excuses. Yeah. Oh, he said, Oh, the Lord has promised us good. Oh, and the land is good. Oh, why, where's your faith today? Yeah. Oh, I but, oh, and many of them, yeah. it said, oh, they began to pick up stones, oh, the stone in there, oh, why it old, yeah. uh, Caleb and Joshua, oh, they walked away and rent their clothes, oh, and began to pray, yeah. oh, don't look to, oh, this world for comfort, oh, I don't think, oh, you know what, oh, we need one another, oh, in the church sometimes, sure. I get weak in this land, oh, I get down and out, oh, but I'm putting, oh, my faith, oh, yeah. and my father, oh, why for he, oh, he promised me, oh, that he'd always be there, oh, he promised me, oh, when I was 16 years old, oh, that he, that he loved me, yeah. and that if I'd only listened to him, he'd never lead me astray. You know what, we get in the way an awful lot here in this world, what we do, sometimes I think, well, I know what's best here. And why? And I'm just going to go and do and plan everything out one step at a time. But sometimes that takes faith right out of the equation. <laughs> you know what? We need to lean on the Lord in our daily walks. Because like, like old Solomon, like he found out when he wrote Ecclesiastes and he said, why everything else in this world is just vanity and vexation yeah, of spirit. That's right. Why there's nothing in this world that you can physically pick up and fill the void of my God. No it's just vanity and vexation yeah. of spirit. Yeah. Our whole duty in this life is to worship and serve the Lord and to strive for Him in all things and to be a good influence and to lead others to that way. Well, that's all that we can do. 
just strive for the greater calling here because I'm telling you, I want my Lord, He didn't come with an iron fist and He didn't come knocking people out of the way. Uh, but He said, come unto me, all ye that labor, and I'll give you rest today. He's got mercy and love yeah, here. Oh, uh, well, He doesn't have a, a whole big rule book. Uh, but He says, come unto me as you are. Yeah. There's something wrong yeah. with you. Oh, uh, well, my God, He'll pick you up. Oh, uh, well, He'll tell you. Oh, uh, well, He'll talk to you. Oh, uh, well, but love one another. Oh, uh, why? Because God, oh, uh, He loved you uh, yeah. before everything. Uh, yeah. Before He created this world. Oh, uh, right. He knew who you were. Oh, uh, He knew you. Uh, Oh, I as he carried oh, on the cross up the hill. Oh, and people uh, spit at him and threw things at him yeah. and pulled his beard out. Oh, he yeah. dug that cross oh, up Calvary's hill. Oh, and he did it anyway because uh, he loved you. Oh, and he, oh, and he spread his arms out. Oh, and he said, oh, and Lord, oh, and he said, God, oh, and take me home. Yeah. You know what? And I truly believe, you know, everything that He did was for a purpose. Every minute that He was here was for you and me. Yeah. It was never for Him and for His justification. But it was because He loved us. Absolutely. And, I, and He would do it all, all over again. He, he shows me every day. His love and mercy is new every single day. <laughs> Dad, you go ahead and come on and, and preach for a few minutes. and been awfully good.